Okay, here's the situation. Yesterday, I went to the Tampa Bar Camp slash Code Camp, which is like an unconference where people sign up to give talks all day, uh, mostly technology related, but some of them just life, business, or whatever you want to talk about related. Um, but one of the issues was uh, that I had a BlackBerry with me, uh, like a Z10, and my friend had a Windows phone, a Nokia, and the conference app that they were using to give the schedule and everything um, was the uh, the Exmo app, um, which at the t at this time doesn't have a web uh, facing, uh, you know, doesn't have a web face or web app version of it. You just it, it's only you know it only works if you have an Android or an iPhone. Uh, Android phone or, or, an, or an iPhone smartphone so uh, anyways so we were like well crap we can't even get the schedule that they're updating on the fly as people sign up for uh, to, to present and so I was like well what are we gonna do it keep going back to the board and figuring out what we want to go to or we could have wrote down everything we want but the nature of a bar camp is that you know sometimes stuff changes and people decide not to give a talk or somebody else you know they trade places or whatever you know but anyways so I found a solution to that one day later which um, is uh, this new I don't, actually I don't really know how new it is but this kind of, this app called a uh, Jenny motion and Jenny motion is like an Android virtual machine that's so much faster and quicker than any other um, Android emulator that I've, I've found thus far. I was like totally blown away to see that this I got this to actually work this morning. So Genie Motion basically has a ton of um, different uh, Android VMs that you can download to run uh, you know Android on the fly and this would have helped perfectly because I would have been able to I have my laptop with me so I would have been able to download uh, an instance of Android or, or run it locally real quickly for using this app. Um, I did have the uh, ADT and the SDK for Android on my machine at one point. It wasn't there now. But um, so what I decided to do, uh, excuse the loud banging of uh, little human beings that are so big in your heart. Anyways, um, but um. So this Genie Motion allows you to out download instances of Android. For instance, I downloaded this uh, complete Google Nexus. It has Google Apps on it. Um, this is the resolution. Uh, you can see I had to stop the virtual device before I can actually restart it. Um, so let me go ahead and shut this down. It kind of lets you see how it how it starts up when you when you use it. Um, there's a settings for this this instance of Android but say if I wanted to add another instance I just click add then I did have to sign up for a Jenny motion account in order to to uh, do this uh, which was quick and easy they you know sign up here fill out four form fields and they'll uh, email you a little link to confirm your email and your account and then you're good to go so on here there's a quite a few different uh, you know instances of Android that you can download the whole thing's put together you don't have to really configure anything uh, in order to get it to run this all the some of the main devices that are out there in, in the tablets with and without Google Apps to, at different resolutions with different versions of Android on it um, different releases 16 17 and so on and so forth um, I'm not gonna add another one I'm just gonna go ahead and launch this one by clicking play since this is already selected now th at this point before it did ask me where my instance of the SDK was and so to get that just in case you don't know uh, use the uh, I think I can you can look up or Google Android ADT and I just downloaded the bundle right here uh, for Windows and some on a Windows machine downloaded this bundle um, and then from the download I basically used a program called 7-zip 
um, or whatever zip program you use as long as it's legal I like 7-zip so I open the archive and I just dragged out the bundle into here so this gives me a, 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 a version of the Android developer tools to uh, to use as the back end so to speak of my Jenny Motion Android phone that I just started right here it's funny it says charging that's actually how much battery is left on my computer right now but it's plugged up so it's charging um, and so basically here we have an Android now of course this is not going to go through the setup on here I already did that logging in with my real Android username and password since this did have, did have gaps or G apps uh, which is like the Google standard apps that come with it um, you can uh, and it's really fast that's another thing about it you can go ahead and go to the Android store and download whatever app you need in this case for this conference I needed Exmo which is in my history since I searched for it before I'm just gonna click there or tap there you know just imagine we're tapping but I'm actually clicking with my mouse go ahead and install that on the phone and this is so fast I'm just like so amazed it runs so much better than the last time I tried to do this yes you're, it's on a Wi-Fi anyways it's on my running on my laptop so you know the, the Wi-Fi is on downloaded that quick so from here I can go ahead and upload uh, open up Exmo and it's gonna tell me to swipe so I'm actually dragging and swiping left let's get started and this would have helped me perfectly yesterday at that Tampa Bay bar camp that I was at um, I'll just say Tampa Bar Camp. Just to kind of show you what it was. This is where I, this is where I went yesterday. It was it was pretty phenomenal compared to the bar camp we had here in Orlando. I think they had a bigger turnout, and it's just nice to be inside the whole time as opposed to going around to the different um, venues. Even though we it gave a lot of good business to the businesses downtown in Orlando. I really like the Tampa Bay Bar Camp a little bit more, but um, the Orlando Bar Camp was sweet as well. But uh, this, I like this just a little bit more. Maybe just because I like being inside and not walking around outside and feeling sweaty and stuff like that. So uh, back to my app on my pseudo Android Galaxy Nexus. Um, I'll search for Tampa. I'm just gonna put Tampa in here. Ah, Tamps. Yeah, that's gonna work. That always works, right? And yeah, here's the bar camp that ended yesterday. So I'm just going to open that event. It's going to download the event data. It's still blazing pretty fast. And from there, I could get I can get the schedule that you know I couldn't get yesterday, <laughs> which isn't really going to help me now. But I know going forward, if I have my BlackBerry with me and my laptop with me which I did yesterday um, then I can if I need an event app that like Exmo or another one that they might be using for that event um, I won't have any problem trying to uh, look at the schedule you know of the speakers and what room they're gonna be in and so on and so forth um, so yeah so that's basically it that's a uh, Jenny motion Exmo the event app um, helping me to run an Android instance in a little VM and download uh, other VMs on the fly if I need to um, stop that instance from the Jenny Motion uh, I guess repository wherever it is somewhere out there on the web maybe on their website that's it thanks